<laughs> Ticklish tomatoes, eggs, ooh, pineapple, blue daffodil nectar. That's what I can see in the last slice of Hattie's tart anyway. But which ingredient comes first? And which one lasts? And which one goes in the middle? And which one goes in between the first and the last in the middle? When I'm baking something again, I like to start with the recipe. Maybe we could try it my way? I'll try it this, that, and any whichever way. Step one is measuring all our ingredients. Let's start with the pineapple. I usually use measuring cups like this. One cup should do it. Step two is mixing the ingredients. For this part, I like to add a little flair. Five, six, seven, eight. Quick, quick, slow. Quick, quick, slow. Now you try. Oh, like this? Quick, quick, slow. Remix. Quick, 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 quick. Slow, slow, slow. Quick, quick, quick. Yeah, too many quicks. Oh! Watch the binding. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Sorry. Hmm. Tastes curious. If we can't recreate your tart with a recipe, maybe we could try it the rabbit way? Sure. What's the rabbit way? We'll make a list of what your tart tastes like. I like to say, follow the taste. Follow it where? To the pantry. And we start at the end. That's a wonderfully wonderland way to start. Usually the last step in baking is tasting your tart, but we're gonna do the last step first. I call it working backwards. I trust in the way of the rabbit. <sighs> Farewell, original mystery tart. Um, hmm, I'm tasting a lot of um, ticklish tomatoes. <laughs> And the jumpin' jelly jam is toasted, which goes well with Ruby Rose radishes. Oh, yeah. I might have had some lying around this morning. See? When remaking any treat, working backwards never fails. Now this I can do. Ha-ha! <laughs> working backwards, here I come. No, Hattie, not like that. Look out for the... Flower. <laughs> okay. Maybe working backwards eh, doesn't work for me. <laughs> Subscribe to find more videos and stay tuned to Disney Junior to watch your favorite shows.